воздушный шнейцы. So this is our goat yard where we've moved the girls. So we moved them away from Peanut because we didn't want to take any chances of anything happening to the babies when they were born or or the girls while they're pregnant. Um, we do keep some ducks in here too, but we'll go over that in a minute. This is Miss Macy. They all got pregnant about the same time, so they should all be due about the 20th of January. So the goat house that we have in there right now is kind of small. Um, so what we're going to do is we're going to get a bunch of supplies and actually show you guys how to make a no-cost goat shelter also in one of our upcoming very soon videos. So these guys over here, they seem to be a lot calmer. This is Macy, like I said. She is the calmest and the most docile one in here. Um, the other ones are doing their thing. I don't think you could see Sadie. She's over there. But um, we do keep ducks in here too. So our Kathy Campbell flock is in here. The dog house is actually not for the goats. I mean, they're welcome to go in it if they want to. But it's more for the ducks to lay their eggs. And as far as the feed, because goats cannot eat duck feed, the feed is kept on the other side of the fence because the ducks can reach their head through the fence and get their feed, whereas the goats cannot. Hi, baby goat. She is a sweetheart. So we have their pool in here, of course, uh, for the ducks. And we empty it to the other side of the fence. We have a bunch of Japanese palms on this side that we're trying to grow. So the duck water is splashing me. <laughs> it's splashy, Macy. So the duck water feeds those. Um, let's see what else. We do have to keep the water up higher than the ducks. Because, you know, ducks muck up water. turn the camera around. Oh, now they got out. I was going to turn the camera around so you could see. But let me get up and show you the whole goat yard. So, there's Macy again. Where did Sadie go? Um, sorry, guys. If I could flip it around, that'd be great, but it won't let me flip it around now. Oh, there's Sadie. That's Sadie. And Miss Georgia Grace is over here enjoying the shade, which I cannot see the camera. Hopefully you can see her. And this is a temporary little hay feeder. Let me get out of the sun so I can see the camera. So the goat shelter is right here. One can fit, I mean, they both, two of them can fit in there, but when they have their babies and stuff, that's not going to be comfortable. So we're going to get a bunch of supplies and show you how to make a no-cost goat shelter. And here's what I was, sorry, Miss Macy. On the other side of the fence, is their feed so they can get through the fence and get their feed but the goats can't and their pool so it's a nice size and everybody gets along pretty well they've been with ducks the whole time they've been here so they're kind of used to it and this is what's going on here pretty soon i think it's like uh Almost three weeks exactly, just a little bit over. We should start seeing some babies. Alright guys, that's it for now. Till later. <coughs>